right here, and this is from Gee Studios. A studio, no S. Um, so this is the little card thing. So it's got a Happy New Year. Joe. I think that's how you pronounce their name. And they put a date for the 8th of January. So they have their a uh, Taobao website as well as a uh, Etsy one as well. But they have a Taobao one down there. And this is their Merry Christmas card. Little Christmas postcard thing. And here is I got a, a free gift in here, so this is, oh, it's a, uh, like a chibi kind of style, mini, what are they called, file folders, that's cute, got Slytherin, Gryffindor, Raising Con, and they have their, Name down the side there. So who do we have here? I got a Marauders map thing over there. Got the Weasley twins and Jenny. Got Luna for Ravenclaw. <laughs> Cedric and Cho Chang for Hufflepuff. Obviously, Cho is Ravenclaw. Gryffindor. We got the Golden Trio and Dobby and a Moaning Myrtle down there. Um. Southern, we've got Draco and I'm guessing that might be Pansy, maybe. We've got a, a Mandrake with a uh, knocked out Neville, I think. That's who it is. That's funny. That's cute. So thank, thank you for including that pretty thingy. Now, here we have. This is the uh, A pin box number two, so. It is the sequel to this one. Let me just reach over and get it. I kept this on my desk. So this is what was in the first box. One of the things. Oh, the acrylic standy for that. I do love acrylic standees. Anyway, so the next one will be the next installment. You know, I really like this for some reason. Very shiny sticker. Very so, uh, rip. Uh, 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 uh. I've shown, but in my scrapbook, I did actually keep this from last time as well. But anyway, that's because I'm weird and I like shiny and it's gold and yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so let's see what goodies are on the side. Mm. It's got very shiny kind of, I guess, ribbon bit. Yeah. Mm. Oh, pin one and pin two. We got some other goodies down there. And <laughs> a interesting. Is this, is this like a? It is. I look inside, it's got one of those, oh man, what are they called? <laughs> um, it's not a paper clip. It is a clip, but not a paper clip. It's a, you know, the word, the word escapes me, but that is so funny. I mean, I can, I can clip my, uh, you can clip paper, you can clip closed, you know, your potato chip bags. And <laughs> that is so funny. 
Well, anyway, I, I just, just went in there. That is a very neat stamp, I gotta say. And I don't want to ruin it either. It's so pretty. Aha! Yay! Yeah. So here is bits. Ah, I know what it is. So this technically, I think, is the cheat sheet. So I'm not gonna look at that yet. On the back, though. It's got... They're... They're... <clears throat> they don't have their Etsy on there. Their Etsy is on their thank you card, though. Okay, so it's got... Magical fan art box. The first um, one of these was uh, red, so this one is green for the second book or whatever. So it's got their design, Weibo, Tabo, and Instagram. So g.u.i underscore studio. That's their Instagram. I can't really read the other ones. But, um, yes. I'll take a closer picture of that. Yeah, so that's your logo. Um, the thank you card. That's very, very pretty. I like roses. It's a very Christmassy color with the red and green going on. Anyway, um... Oh, they got Facebook and Twitter. And the Etsy's down there, too. So I'll take a closer picture of that at the end so you can see better. But here we have two prints. I guess it's two artists. I look on the, on the top, on the back. Anyway, let's move this upwards. So here is a very cool, um, what's his name? Tom Little. And this is the back. And uh, the illustrator up there. No idea what it says, obviously. <laughs> so then next is a very cute Gildaway Lockhart. And some blue Cornish Pixies. And his, uh, his own book, well, with the useless cage. <laughs> and I guess he signed a picture of himself in the back there. Oh, uh, it's, it's pretty cute. The illustrator is K. Summer. There. So, yeah, so that is awesome. So I'm just gonna put these back in the envelope, so I don't lose them. I'm taking a proper picture later. I don't want to lose these. I'll uh, keep the sheet key out for later though. So I'll we'll just put that over there. Put this over there too. I'm going to move some things out of the way. So I'm just prop this up here. Okay, so what is next? Okay, so I'll do this because I already sort of took it out already. Uh, yeah. So I think of the stupid word. Yeah. But this is still amusing. Obviously it's acrylic. 
like it goes, it, uh, it comes together on the inside, so it's not really mocking the actual acrylic outside. So, you just eat it off. So let me just put it right there. <laughs> I can't believe I can't remember this stupid word. Um, okay, whoops. Knocking everything down. Right. So next up, we'll do the pins last, I guess. I'm just random taking out something. Oh, this is cute. Here's some acrylic. Oh yes, I do need to take off a layer, a plastic layer thing on these things. Pretty sure it's on both sides too. See, I like the sound of taking them off. I just can't, I don't like it when I'm trying to find this stupid thing. Okay, so, listen closely. I like the sound. Not as uh, squeaky sounding. Yes, I believe. I need to take both layers off. I think. Finally. Yeah, that's the sound. Anyway, that took ages to get off. Now I just cut it off. Let me add to this thing. Anyway, this is the cute part of the, the blue cornish pixie that is holding a piece of paper. So that's that bit. 
Um, what else? Oh, I'll do the Crookstand Lab statue. Here's the, uh, what's it called? Button badge. I'm not really one to collect these things, but they do actually go up on those felt hexagons I use so very nicely. Ooh, and this has some bits of holographic. He obviously says Tom Riddle. He does look cool with his red eyes though. He's drawn very nicely as well. So that's that. Let's see. There's the only other thing left is the Christian. Okay, so I'll do that last last. So let me just take out what I have to have to do. So so I got some space. Alright, so... We'll do the pin first. the first pin. Is this beauty? Is a, uh, I think, soft enamel? It's like, I'm guessing because like, the enamel's meant to flush on top, like a, a smooth finish. But anyway, let's see what's down here, shall we? We've got um, the foreigner right there. We've got the whopping willow. Wait, is it? Yes. Um, we've got, I guess, Phoenix Feathers. You got the Sword of Gryffindor. We got the Dueling Club scene there. We got, the, I guess, the Basilisk down there. The uh, I Am Lord Voldemort. There. Um, we got Colin Creevy's camera. Hmm. I think that's the Hogwarts Express right there. Oh, Dobby's fingers levitating the birthday cake or whatever cake that was supposed to be. I think this is Hermione, like this bit, it's Hermione and her hand mirror. That might be a rooster. It's all very intricate. And I think this whole thing here is supposed to be the uh, secret entrance in Moaning Myrtle's bathroom. I believe so, anyway. Yeah, it's got lo lots of components on this pin. So, very detailed as well. So that's that pin. The second pin. There's this pin.
This one, I think, is definitely hard now. It is a book to represent the second, the second one. So we've got Sword of Gryffindor, we've got a snake with Tom Riddle, and then there's a skull, there's a number two on like the bookmark ribbon thing. We got HP on the side with a, for some reason, a flying key. Um, yeah, that is, and the snake is glittery. It is really cool. Now, for the last component of this box. We have the acrylic standy. It is only a, a one-sided one, as opposed to the previous one, which was both-sided. Okay, that doesn't really matter because you know which way to turn this thing. I did spy a hole in the middle, so I did it that way. Listen. I do love the sound. <laughs> Though it is kind of like transparent-ish. Well, it's clear background, so you can kind of sort of see my hand through the green bit. Like, like an actual window bit. Yeah, that's cool. So the acrylic stand is much more detailed. Well, you can, you can see the details up close better, really. Let's see if I can get this off the right time. Hey! Okay, listen, listen. I did it. I am weird. Yes. Uh, this is gonna this is gonna take some time. I gotta take the the sticky off the plastic off both sides of this thing. Oh, this part I found pretty quickly. I just love that. But on this side is a bit more tricky. Oh no, I found it. I just love the sound because I'm weird. I do not deny that I am weird. So now we place it in. Oh, that was a nice click there. So did. And ta-da. There we have it. So let me just put it up here. You can see it a bit better, I guess. You can probably see the, the details I was trying to point out on the, on the first pin a bit better. See, Hermione's here with her hand mirror. Creamy's camera. I'm guessing that's supposed to be a rooster. Or it's something else. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell. I mean... I have no idea, really. Oh, wait. Is it supposed to be representing the flood in Myrtle's bathroom? Because, like, that's the sequence it went from 
being, uh, that is being petrified. I have no idea. <laughs> Obviously, we have Dobby's hand with the little cake levitating thing there. We've got the, uh, the car and the train. The dueling club bit. We've got the car in the Forbidden Forest down there. That's what that was. With, uh... I don't know if that's supposed to be a spider, it's just circles and triangles. <laughs> um... See? I mean, it could be a spider. Who knows, boy? Who knows? Um... Obviously, this whole thing here is the sink. Entrance. Those are baths underneath with the sort of Gryffindor hanging out of it. Got a phoenix wing there. I am Lord Voldy there. We've got number two, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Title. But yes, that. Is that. So that's everything in this box, which is pretty cool. We got another little clippy thing. We got a Cornish Pixie keyring. We got a uh, Tom Riddle button badge. Oh, I might as well go over this because this is the cheat sheet, technically. Uh, let's see. Ah, uh, the title for the book is the Parcel Mouse book. For that pin. So it doesn't show the uh, the button badge, the clip, and the and the keyring like you did last time. Hmm. I guess this is the main part. And this is on the other side of that. And I guess it's kind of like a. I don't know if I'm the art cards. I guess. Or like little art card slash postcard things. Because it's got a dotted line to cut out, doesn't it? But anyway, that's pretty cool. That is everything. I do like the wax seal they put on that envelope. Okay, so. And one, and two, and... Put that there. And I'll take a picture. So, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Ring the door for notifications. Do check out Gui Studios. I think that's how you pronounce it, right? Gui? GUI Studio on Instagram and their other social medias. Oh, uh, for now.